Well, there's exciting times in our espresso kitchen this morning. And of course, we have a world-renowned celebrity chef in studio with us who's going to be taking us through a very, very interesting recipe. I can't pronounce the name of it, however, so I will leave it to the professionals. And um, yeah, she's going to be at the Good Food and Wine Show as well, cooking tomorrow. So if you are in and about that area, you have to go and check it out. It starts today. It's one of those things that absolutely is so much fun, not only for individuals, but for family and for everybody else. So let me give you a little bit of an introduction into who this lady is. Now, she's a head pastry chef for the Mondrian Hotel in Los Angeles. She is a graduate of the Cordon Bleu and the Le Notre in Paris. She trained at Fashion Patisserie and also attended the European Business School in London, majoring in international marketing and finance. She's cooked for celebrities such as Tom Hanks, Nicole Kidman, President Clinton, Brad Pitt, and Madonna, just to name a few. And of course, Ariana Bundy, who we're going to meet right now, has appeared on TV shows such as the BBC's Good Food Live, Sky's Taste, and our very own SABC 3's Top Billing. Good morning, Ariana. Morning. How are you? I'm very well. How are you? I'm very well. I feel a little, you know, you know, like I'm a groupie here. So really? lovely to meet Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank Wonderful. you for having me. Yes, yes. It's so good to have you here today. You're making a very inter interesting recipe for us, right? Yep. Mm -hmm. Like I said, I can't pronounce the names. So you have to tell us what it's Actually, called. Actually, it's called cake and mamani. Cake and mamani. Cake and cake, okay, cake, cake meaning cake. Yeah. E meaning of. Yes. Mamani means grandmother. Oh. And also the name for cute. Wonderful. So, yeah. Wonderful. So you say mamani cute and grandmother. That's awesome. So yeah. wonderful. What are we going to be needing for cake and mamani today? Okay. So um, we have flour. Yeah. Sugar. Um, oil or butter. Okay. Uh, baking soda, baking powder, right. and um, eggs, vanilla. I'm using a little bit of lemon zest, okay. but also I have yogurt, which makes this cake really interesting. Yes. This is the cake that most Iranians grow up um, making and yes. learning, and and then um, uh, and then making for every day. And of course, you're American Iranian descent, yes. right? Okay. Yes. Awesome. Let's start this up. While you're starting okay. this up, I see that you've brought your book here along for yeah. us, Pomegranates and Roses. And what I love about this book is it's got little stories and little anecdotes about mm. growing up. Um, and a lot of stories about your grandmother because this cake is in the book as well. Okay? Absolutely, yes. That's awesome. So while you're making that, let me just see here. My mother got, my grandmother got the recipe from her piano teacher's wife, Mrs. Bobkin. That's right. An, an Armenian Iranian violinist. Yes, yes. My mom told me that when she and my aunt were little, my grandmother wouldn't give them any sweets or cake for a few days before her piano lesson. Then when they went with her, she would give them each a slice of yogurt cake like we're having right now. Yes. They were so thrilled that they didn't mind the long wait outside the classroom so much. So that's lovely, hey? It's I not, know. It's not, it's um, got, you know, the, the book is filled with memories and anecdotes and culinary yeah. culture. And so what I've done here is I've mixed the flour, baking soda, baking powder, a pinch of salt. Yeah. And here I'm um, zesting the sugar. Okay. Um, rather, whisking the sugar whisking with some zest. Whisking it together, nice. To release the flavor. Can you smell it? I can smell All it. All the it's oils and everything. That's Lovely. Awesome. So then I'm adding the the eggs. Okay. So what, what happens is um, you're just gonna keep whisking that mm -hmm. and then you're gonna add your eggs and you're gonna whisk this yes. lot for about three to four minutes in an electric okay. handheld mixer. All right. So it's nice and creamy. Okay. So while you're busy doing that, there's also going yeah. to be 10 celebrities that's going to be cooking at the Good Food and Wine Show. I'm yes. one of them as well. And Ariana was so kind to be giving me some tips on exactly how I can make my dish. Because I'm going to be cooking, or well, not cooking, I'll be preparing sushi. And I've never done it in my life I before. Know. So I'm it's hoping so that easy. I can still possibly win this. So I'm so, adding the yogurt. Yes. Full fat, low fat, whatever you like. All right. And the vanilla. Nice. Okay. It's smelling amazing already. Butter or oil. Olive oil is also nice. And you're just going to mix the lot. Ooh, oh, a little fork flew about in the just kitchen. That big. So you're going to need to the taste lot. this later. Yeah, it's really good. Really easy, as go. you can see. So Amazing. sometimes what my grandmother did was whisk the egg whites to soft peaks and then folded it in. Yeah, yeah. But I really like things to sim be simple. I have a three year old. Yeah. I don't have any time. Okay. Well, so. while you're mixing that, let me just do the competition. There's an awesome competition, and you can win a set of double general tickets to the Good Food and, Good Food and Wine Show in Cape Town between today 
and the 27th of May. Now, the day is going to be filled with lots of action-packed fun and, and fun galore. All you have to do is SMS PNP to 33728 and you stand a chance to win double set of general tickets to the Good Food and Wine Show. So that's wonderful. PNP to 33728. And of course, the key word to get this recipe is cake. Send cake to 33728 and you could get this recipe sent to your mobile phone. Once it is done, it's going to go on our green mat over here. There we go. And this is basically what it looks like, hey Ariana, when it's That's done. That's right, yeah. And you can make a gluten-free version. Gluten-free version. Absolutely. I love it. I love the sound of that. And um, Wonderful. And you can add chocolate chips, blueberries, um, spread it with jam at the end. Yeah. And make a completely different cake. Cool. So once, once we have our final product, all we can do here is just cut it up and then, of course, garnish it as we like, mm, hey? Absolutely. There we go. Simple, perfect cake to serve for the afternoon for the Lovely. kids when they come home. Yeah, we can just cut one slice there. Okay. And I am going to make sure that my colleague, because I know that she loves, she loves, loves, loves yogurt cake. Liesl, I know she's waiting and ready. To, wow, look at this. To have a good old taste. Liesl, I'm bringing this over to you. You're wait, gonna wait, absolutely wait. love it. Thank you so Go much, right. Ariana Bundy, Thank for being for in our Espresso Kitchen. And we'll check you out at the Good Food and Wine Show. And we'll see you there as well. Over to you, Liesl.